in the last episode, we built up our spawn island, made a cobblestone generator, got some trees going, and then we almost died. Uh, I'm gonna risk it. I'm gonna risk it. I should not have risked it. Oh my god. We almost starved and ran out of food with two hearts left. And then in desperation, we blocked out like 300, 400 blocks to a shipwreck to get some food, which we did get, but we decided it was a good idea to try and go to the Guardian Temple, of all places, the Guardian Temple, to get another water source so we can have an infinite water source. And we about nearly died. And if we didn't die there, we're probably gonna die here. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, welcome back to episode two of Skyblock hardcore so we we still have this problem to deal with behind us but hopefully we can come up with a solution you know what i actually have an idea let's make some trap doors because the mobs will just walk straight over them all right my mining fatigue is gone let's go ahead and break these we're gonna place down our trap doors where are they here they are oh there we go Place down our trap doors and we should be able to just pop them open and the mobs will walk right across them. So let's go ahead and put down the other one. Let's try not to fall off here. There we go. Now if we go over here, we should be able to lure this creeper. Oh, this could go bad. And if we pop these open, they should fall down. Let's go, baby. Let's go. We have escaped. We have escaped the shipwreck with our lives all we gotta do is just go up the water and head back to base where we've got our carrots you know we've got some mob loot hopefully we can get back there get some carrots growing up and not have any more issues with food because that is our, our biggest thing we got going on right now all right it's time to return back to base if you did not see last time this is where our mob spawner is going to be but i just want you to look at this island and remember it because it's going to change a lot this episode all right, now we're back. I've gone ahead and gathered up just an entire inventory of cobblestone because we're going to need it for all the projects that we want to take care of. I've also went ahead and planted down a bunch of carrots so that we don't run out of any food. But let's just go ahead and jump into a time lapse because we're building quite a bit. Okay, so bear with me. I may have went a little crazy, but we got one little portion left. 
where I may have built up the rest of the base in the middle. So let's check that out real quick. So the, the mob spawner is up and running. It's it's doing a fantastic job. The base has been completely transformed. We got a little staircase going up to the top here, but we have our storage system over here, which we can put all of our loot into. Uh, and actually, because we got string, we were able to craft. Let me show you. Uh, we were able to craft some beds because now we can get wool. So that means we actually have a bed that we can sleep through the night in now which is fantastic uh we do have some leftover cobblestone we did do a lot of mining for cobblestone let's see if i can cobblestone 4623 mined yeah yeah we we mined a we mined a lot of cobblestone but we did manage to get some music discs uh eventually we will try and get all of these um, but this is just our rare items. We got an iron sword from one of them down in there. We also got an iron ingot, which I don't know what I'm going to use it for yet, but I'm going to hold on to it because it is part of a recipe for a few crafting benches, um, a few different benches that we might need. Uh, we are eventually going to have an iron farm, so this isn't going to be an issue in the future. I just need to decide what I want now. Uh, the potato, which is amazing. We're going to actually start growing potatoes and be able to cook those and have a, a really good food source. Um, we have our obsidian, flint, and steel, and our buried treasure map. Uh, we also got some armor. Uh, our best armor is going to go up here. Uh, right now, I'm just putting up the chain link armor and, and some of the other armor just to make it look good. Um, but we have, again, our staircase that goes up here. There's nothing up here just yet. We got our tree farm, and that is where our grass is going to go. Um, you can see it's finally spread over there. It's going to spread out a little bit. And that's just you know, it's going to be a little garden area. We're not going to plant crops there. I think we're going to make a micro farm instead. Um, but we do have a cobblestone generator designed over here. It's a two-sided one. Eventually, this one will become uh, basalt. We'll get some blue ice in here along with, uh, I think it's soul sand or something. We're going we're gonna to make basalt. It's going to be a much better building material for us. Than, than cobblestone where we have to smelt it. We have our furnaces and our infinite water source. I did quite a lot. I did quite a bit. But I think the plan is going to be that we start bridging off of this platform right here. Now, whenever we want to get to stuff. So, like, I, I did build this too high initially, and I had to chop down this bottom area. They were just falling and dying. I just, I don't know how I miscounted. I just miscounted, like, 15 blocks, 10, 15 blocks. I don't know how I did it. Uh, genuinely, I'm as baffled as you are. But we're going to, like, right here, we'll probably build a nice staircase going up there, have a nice little platform over there. We'll probably do the same here. Except we'll go out and we'll build another one of these. And so we'll have a lower area and an upper area over here. And then for over here, we are going, you know, we're, we're, we're going to keep this. Um, now, I could just build my nether portal like right here or like down there somewhere. But I do want to I do want to keep this little island and I want to use this portal right here. I think it's cool looking. So we'll probably build like a staircase going up and then like a bridge all the way over there and get rid of this cobblestone. And that way we can just come come up here, run over and then we can use that area to bridge off to different areas like that or over there or anything else that we may see in the distance. Uh, for this, 
I don't know what the plan is with this so far. This is just, this is a very long way to go to build a bridge. Um, not entirely sure what we're going to do, but we'll do something pretty cool. I, I know that for sure. But first, before we do that, I will actually do, I want to build it out of these, these bricks. From, from now on, anything above this level, I want it all to be nice and pretty. So we're going to use these, but we do not actually have that many of them right now uh, we have a ton of cobblestone just no fuel so we're gonna have to figure out a fuel source something that's gonna be sustainable long term it might just be trees for now and then eventually if we can get like those stagmites i think they're called we can have infinite lava dripping into cauldrons but we need more iron for that for the cauldrons. so for now i think we're just going to use wood and coal and uh we'll be back when we're building that thing right there it's it's not going to be huge, it's just going to be a nice little bridge that goes up there, a little, little circular platform, somewhere we can be safe while we're killing all of the mobs. And eventually this is going to be, you know, refaced and made better, it's going to look better, we'll put, you know, some decoration around this, but for now, cobblestone gets the job done. We have fuel, baby, let's go! We got some wood smelting over here turn that into fuel and i'm just tossing it in here getting our smooth stone which will turn into stone bricks you know i think i've decided what i want to do with this uh i think my best bet now correct me if i'm wrong if i should have done something different but i think my best bet is going to be to make a shield yeah i think i think that is my best bet because that's going to offer me more protection than any armor that I can make. So I think that's a good choice going ahead and making the shield there. You know what? Yeah. Yeah. I'm happy with that decision. I'm not doubting myself at all. Maybe. All right. So our grass is spreading really nice over here. Uh, again, this is just a little area for us to grow some trees around the outside here. We're also going to put a nice little garden here. Uh, and any apples that we get from now on, we are going to save because whenever we go to the nether, uh, we're going to be able to get gold from piglins and make it into golden apples. Then the zombie villagers that we have over here, we're going to be able to take them out, turn them into regular villagers and create iron farms and also trade with them, get diamond armor, diamond tools. Uh, it's going to speed up the game a lot. We can get glass. There's a ton of things that we can get from trading and a ton of iron that we can get for like hoppers and everything. The only thing that I don't understand how to get, or maybe I'm just missing it. The only thing is redstone. Uh, I know I can kill witches that come from here, but that's, that's a lot of grinding for a very little amount of redstone because they don't spawn in here that often. And when they do spawn the chance of them dropping redstone isn't, you know, 100% every time. So if you have any ideas on how I could get some redstone, please let me know in the comments, please. If you have any ideas whatsoever, if there's something that I'm just completely missing, just tell me. Let me know in the comments down below. The sunset just looks so damn good in this shader pack, which reminds me, I got to sleep. But did y'all see the eclipse the other day? I did. A little bit of a... Uh pictures and, and footage of of what i saw during the eclipse i wasn't in totality unfortunately but i was in 2017 on my birthday august 21st and that was that was something really special so yeah i, I hope you managed to get to see the eclipse and i, I hope you enjoyed it because it is you know like a once in a lifetime kind of thing to to experience now we should be able to go ahead and make this bridge over here so let's cut to the time lapse of me doing that
All right, so I think I'm happy with this so far. I mean, with what we've got, I think I've done a pretty good job. We don't have a huge amount of resources yet, so I just I put torches down in here, but I did these three high um, slabs and then the, the wall in between it. I'm going to leave the floor because I do kind of like it being cobblestone. As, as much as cobblestone is horrible, I think it blends well in. And I think if it was all just the same, it would get a little bit boring. I know it's pretty boring already, but I think it would just get a little bit more boring. But we have transitioned it here as best that we could. And then we built, you know, just a, a staircase. It's, it's literally just that simple. We have to design this little part and obviously the rest of this. But for now, I think that's good. I think that's where we're going to leave it at for now. We're, obviously, we're going to get rid of everything that's underneath of here because we you no longer need any of this we can just come straight up here and go to the the mob farm and again we're going to do the same thing on the other side here but we're going to make a little platform but i think we're going to do that in the next episode and we're also going to go can you guess can you guess where we're going to go we're going to go to the nether we're going to go to the nether next episode. Probably going to make a very basic piglin farm. Start getting some gold. Start doing some bartering. I know we can get some good stuff from bartering. And uh, yeah. I think it's going to be a whole lot of fun. So if you haven't already, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Comment down below. Tell me, how can I get redstone? How can I get diamonds? And let me know if you liked the video. Was it too many time lapses? Not enough, you know, talking or, you know, let me know, please. I, I don't know unless you tell me. All right. See you all in the next episode. Peace.